Oh wow, so cool. I've never seen this before. Ever, ever, ever. Oh wow, wow, wow. Oh, but how do I do this? I'll tell you. First, what you want to do is using the bucket tool, you want to make the entire screen black, and then you want to add a layer, drag that second layer down, and then set the color to red. Second thing you want to do is with your color still as red and your bucket tool still on, you want to set that to red, okay? You want to set the entire thing to red, then you want to draw two lines, fill that in with the bucket, get the yellow, draw two lines, fill that in with the bucket, get the green, yeah, blue, yeah, purple, yeah, and then just like whatever other colors you want in the middle, except for black. Don't do black. Yay, woohoo, we're done, yay! Yay, yeah, we did it! Now you wanna grab your eraser and then just draw on it like you would with a pen. Still doesn't look quite right though. Doesn't look like one of those scratch pads. What you wanna do is you wanna go back to your rainbow layer and you want to use the smudge tool as much as you possibly can. Get all the colors spread out basically as equal as they can be and just keep doing that until they are. After that, the blended color should look a lot more natural whenever you use it, the eraser tool on it. So just set the size to like pretty small, oh, that's too big, yeah. Set it to a smaller size, that way it'll look like you're scratching it off. And thanks for watching.